Hello, happy Thanksgiving to you. Now, I know it would be so easy for many people to just sit and say, you know what, this year has just been horrible and I don't have many reasons to be thankful. And I just want to caution all of us, myself included, to not really take on that mindset to really focus in on the many reasons why we have to be thankful and highlighting and choosing the reasons why you have to be thankful is not you living in denial to all the negative things that have taken place this year because let me tell you as i've watched different events unfold my heart has just ached on more than one occasion but i have made the decision over and over again to not sit in that heartache right um but to really highlight the many reasons why i have um to give God thanks, to, to highlight the many blessings that are in my life. And again, this is not a denial of the things that's going on around me, but it's a choice that I am making to highlight and to magnify the reasons why I have to give God thanks. So I encourage you to do the same, not just on today where you're almost forced to do something like that but to just make it a daily habit believe me it is such a game changer one of the many reasons um, why I am thankful this year is just for you all I have to say that I have just been really surprised quite honestly with um, just the different individuals that have subscribed to my channel because honestly when I first started it this channel um, I didn't really see it going in this direction and I was okay with that like my intentions have never been to be like oh yeah I just want to blow up you know on YouTube no um, my heart has always been you know what I just want to help people and as I am learning and discovering different things I just want to share it and that's always just been um, the posture of my heart and all of this so for those of you that are subscribed I really want to say thank you for me it's not just about, oh, I want a certain amount of um, subscribers. I'm more concerned, quite honestly, about the amount of people that actually watch the videos and not only watch the videos, but um, are inspired in a good way to make the right changes, right? So to me, that just means a lot. And I really appreciate the different comments that have well, most, because we've had some interesting comments along the way, but <laughs> I appreciate most of the comments that you all have left and just the sweet words of encouragement and even some of the advice that you have provided, because the truth is I don't know it all, right? None of us do. And um, sometimes people have left different comments that led me to just Google away and do some more research. So Anyway, I just wanted to say thank you. In any case, uh, I just pray that you have a wonderful Thanksgiving and that you don't go crazy today, right? And just eat all the things that you know you shouldn't, knowing that you're going to pay for it tomorrow. So just be mindful with how you approach it. This morning, I had some ground beef with some suet in it. And as most of you know, I'm really trying to do more of a higher fat approach to carnivore. Um, and you can just click on my interview with uh, Becky Niles to get more information on, on that. But in any case, this morning I just had some ground beef and some suet. And for dinner, I just plan to have a turkey and some suet and be totally content and okay with that. For my family, I am doing like some other sides. We have really stayed away from dairy, but I had some special requests for some sides. So I figured we could do some keto sides or I could prepare some keto sides for them. And I also made some squash. That is pretty much it. That's, you know, just keeping it simple and just enjoying the day. And again, a happy Thanksgiving to you and thank you for all your support. You be blessed.